it's hard to believe it's 30 years since Green Left uh, began. I remember in the early days, what, what a shock to the mainstream media, the arrival of this new newspaper was. There was much from the usual suspects. Uh, and the main message from them was, you know, it won't last. It won't last. It's not viable. How can they? I mean, they've just got all these people handing it around and sending it to people. And um, it's not dependent on corporate advertising. How, how can it possibly last? Well, of course, <clears throat> that's ridiculous because Green Left has not only lasted, but it's play, played such a vital role in what is so often um, misnamed as the free press. I, it's one of the free press is one of those terms that is so abused. But Green Left represents the truly free press in this country, because in that 30 years, a great deal has happened to what we, another misnomer, what we call the mainstream media. <clears throat> I started in the mainstream media and have spent all my career, I suppose, in the mainstream media. Um, and what, in that time, in the 30 years, uh, extraordinary changes have happened. There used to be spaces in the mainstream media, very small spaces, but they were spaces for the likes of me or uh, other reporters uh, who, who were considered mavericks, who were dissenters, all the terms. So you, left wingers was the usual term, but that, that was, I was very pleased that they call me that, but that was usually a term of derision. But there were the spaces, Robert Fisk, Seymour Hirsch, uh, and, 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 and others, certainly in Australia as well. Those spaces have closed, they've gone. The mainstream media has shut down, it is now one echo chamber of propaganda, representing something it always did, it always represented the establishment, we know that, but now its, it's propaganda is quite virulent. And that makes Green Left Weekly so important because the true free press, the true open space, is in a free newspaper like Green Left. That's why, why Green Left, um, its place in Australia is, is almost historic. And I, all I can say is that I'm terribly proud to be associated with Green Left, to be able to do this endorsement. And I salute all the comrades who make it happen. Issue after issue. Congratulations.